Well, DC, this is a true mixed martial artist of the highest order. You've watched the film. Hard for me to see much in terms of glaring weaknesses, and he believes he can react to anything that is thrown his way inside that arc. It's unbelievable because whenever you're trying to prepare for someone, you look for weaknesses. But when you watch this guy, you, nothing jumps off the page. When you think I have to go wrestle him, you realize very quickly that not only can he defend takedowns, he can also go and secure them sure. himself. He's that new breed of fighter that has been doing every discipline from the very start of his career. You know you're looking at a guy that will contend for a championship. And if our fighter meeting on Thursday is any indication, confidence, not an issue for this young man coming in here tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Latifi is six years his senior. He weighed in at 205 pounds. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. All right, now for the particulars, we go inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 16 wins, 8 losses, and 1 no contest. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Malmo, Sweden, Ilya, the Sledgehammer, Latifi! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it a job of mixing everything up. Well, I'm an identical twin. Two is better than one. You might as well double up on the jab. He did so effectively there. Doubling up on the jab, and you see his opponent's head popping back every time it lands. Latifi gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. 
timely defense there. Huge block for him. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? And able to avoid the punch there. Nice slip by Alir Latif. Oh, knee strike right to the midsection there. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Nice kick there by Lee. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. It's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice its size. This guy today is looking at focus bits in his opponent. Three minutes now to go in this one. Big. Right I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he is on Beach Street right now. He's seeing Tweety Birds over the top of his head. When you take a hook like that, you are on wobbly legs. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Lee's kick blocked. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, slips to avoid the right. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Head kick, that's a miss. Some nice back and forth action here. Ooh, that uppercut landed for him. Oh, straight right. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Oh, nice jab. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Latifi's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. He blocks the punch. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Latifi gets hit by that leg kick. Liver kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to show up the defense here, though. Trying to establish that jab once again. I mean, he's cutting down the size with a beautiful leg kick. Oh, and he counters with a straight left. That landed flush. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Beautiful kick. And that one certainly found the target. Look at him chopping the wood. Chopping the wood with those leg kicks. Inside leg kick lands. Oh, Latifi gets caught with that punch. All right, DC, let's look at some of the highlights from the last round. Lot for the replay guys to choose from. Yeah, man, these guys stood on a quarter in the middle of the octagon. Take one to give one. Over and over, each guy landed, and they both landed very well over the course of that first round. All right, so here we go with our next round. DC, you are known for having one of the higher fight IQs in the game, and I would put him on that list after what we saw in terms of the body work there. He did a fantastic job of mixing up his target, not headhunting, going to the body, making that investment into forcing a mistake later that will allow him to chase the finish. Right hand upstairs. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. 
Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Big punch land. Ooh. Trying to double up on that jab. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, that right hand is on point. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Attack that leg. Oh, big head kick lands. Oh, big punch lands. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Lee's got a pretty deep bruise now starting to appear on the right side of his body. His opponent has done a lot of work in that region tonight. Swing and a miss with that punch by Latif. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Slips the punch nicely there. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job fighting the range to land those punches. Nice straight right lands. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Can't take many of those, you better check. Those are going to start to take their effect. Lee gets caught with that punch. Blocks the shot. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Just missed with the left there. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh, he lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Big kick. Oh, big left hook there. Establish that jab. Well, he misses with the left punch there. One minute on the clock. Good punch. Pretty significant well to the left side. Just misses there with the left. Head kick. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Get those combinations going. Move. Oh, and he continues to pour it on. We mentioned earlier the aggression with his striking. Got to be careful to not gas out here, but at least you have to admire the approach. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Oh, looked like that left hand found the target. Found the target as it has on so many occasions tonight. Look at the turtle in that kick. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so that's the end of the round. Pretty significant damage done in that round. Cut on the cheek, sustained there from that strike. Now the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Better to be below the eye than above it, sure. But nonetheless, this could be a factor now moving forward. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take us through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. 
He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Nice straight punch. Latifi gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. that comes from him throwing that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. That one stuck in. Nice strike. Oh, nice combination there by Lee. Massive head kick! Both of these guys going all out. High action fight here. Left hook, right hand. Oh, straight right. Big kick land. Latifi's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Clean left punch followed by the right. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Big head kick land. Oh, good kicks there. Just misses with the jab there. Big body kick land. Effective straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got it hurt very bad. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, he continues to find the openings tonight. Beautiful connection with the punch there. Accuracy at its best. What a body kick. Stay sharp. Ooh, blocks the shot. Way to hide that leg kick. Good sequence of kicks there by Lee. Out of range with that kick attempt. Damage on the right side of his body, starting to really bruise now. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Look at him drive his shin into his own body with that body kick. Ooh, big shot, man. Man, his side kick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good side kick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he attempts that certain strike. Beautiful body kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Head kick attempt, it's blocked. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Latifi gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Real sneaky body kick. Right on the button. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Beautifully timed and placed kick there by Alir Latif. Ten seconds.
minutes to go. Ooh, nice, nice right hand. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up, staying active, keeping busy, doing great work. All right, so there's the end of the round. The big moment in it, of course, the shot to the liver that buckled his opponent. He heard it bad. He went right to the liver. Boom, landed it on the sweet spot. And was very surprised that opponent, his opponent was able to stand up to him. But he's going down the right path. He needs to continue to throw these strikes to the body. All right, so next round underway here. And you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp. And it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Just missed with that right hand. Latifi shot is blocked. Well, most fighters... Oh, that's the fight plus four. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Nice strike. Liver kick. Good right here. Powerful leg kick land. about that chin. Well, a case of pick your poison here, if you drop the elbow defensively to lessen the body damage, you open yourself up upstairs. He is in some serious trouble now. Latifi's strike attempt there is blocked. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done. Just misses with the jab. Ooh, what a punch. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Lee gets tattooed by that stiff jab. Improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Dig and kick. after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 27 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Ilya the Sledgehammer Lakini! All right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything.